Hey everybody, BrickLover18 with a very first episode of Minifigure Monday. So welcome to Monday, everybody's favorite day of the month. Well, every Monday now, from now on until further notice, I'm going to review a minifigure. And in case you haven't seen the video I've already posted about this, a minifigure, a, it can be a custom minifigure, a sig fig, uh, just a normal minifigure, a CMF minifigure from a retired series, even a small set. And by small set, it comes in a poly bag. That's it. If it comes in a poly bag, it can be considered a minifigure for Minifigure Monday. So if you have a minifigure or a sig fig you want me to review, you let me know in the comments or or you can send it to me to review. If it's a, if it's I'll review it if I have it and if I don't have it, I probably just won't review it. You if you really want me to do it, you can send it to me though. But today for the very first episode of Minifigure Monday, we will review Benny. So Benny is an awesome minifigure. So here we go. Benny from the Lego movie likes to say spaceship, spaceship, spaceship. And he's a 1980-something vintage spaceman. He's obviously a vintage blue spaceman. This minifigure contains five parts. It, it includes the legs, the torso, the head, the helmet, and of course, the jetpack. So I'll just do a 360 on this minifigure here before we go into close-ups. This is a really cool looking minifigure, so let's, let's talk about it. So the pants, they're just normal blue pants. There's nothing special about them. The torso, the torso is really cool. There's no back printing, but there is front printing, and that is this vintage space logo. It's got the logo, and, but it's all one piece. Like the, the old space logos were sort of similar to this, but the gold always rubbed off. So this one, it shows gold somewhat on. It's the red and white that's rubbed off a lot. Um, it's the design of it though and it just looks really cool so I'm showing you that now we'll move up to the helmet the helmet is a really cool piece it is very similar to the vintage helmets it's not like the newer models where it has like the little inlet for the visors but it's crap and if you're wondering is it actually broken no it's not it's molded this way so it does not look like it has come over and cracked it but I have a lot of helmets that are cracked because the, I played with my dad's vintage space stuff still has it but not at our house and it's the helmet's cracked in this position and then finally the head on this side I'm showing you right now is the very happy when he's yelling spaceship 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 and he's got a big black mouth with a red tongue and these big black eyes and on the other side it's just the classic standard we still get it today just the two dots and a smile for or like a smile for the face so it's not really this one's not really special but this is a very very this is an expensive minifigure. I have sold a copy for $18, so that's a, that's a lot of money to me. And yeah, that's all I have to say. Thank you for watching my very first Minifigure Monday episode. Stay tuned for more. If you have any suggestions for Minifigure Monday, please leave them down in the comments below and I will try and get to them. I will let you know if I can do it or I can't do it. Just so you're not hoping to get it and it doesn't actually happen. So thank you for watching this video by BrickLover18. Leave your leave your suggestions below and answer today's video question which can be found in the description. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.